a little spare room of parts. You guys will be seeing this stuff soon. But uh, we're taking this to go get sandblasted and Cerakoted today. We're going to get it uh, a bronze to match the wheels and then maybe even eventually uh, intake going. I want to use the racing line box and then have a Cerakoted or at least powder coated same color as my wheels or same color as this will turn out from the racing line box to the turbo. I think I'd make the bay look really nice. But first things first, we're going to load this up to the car, take it to the shop. They said they got to order the color and uh, whatnot. So it might be a little over a week, which I'm hoping it won't. I'm hoping it'll be ready by Friday next week because next weekend I have a bunch of time. So I'll have time to install this downpipe. Not this coming weekend, but the following weekend. And actually, by the time you've seen this video, it should already be done and installed. But I'm really hoping that lines up because I don't have a lot of time. In she goes. I don't know how well I can do this with the camera in my hand. I'm dropping it on myself. Looks like this will hold it decently. Get one of these over that. Yeah. Oh. Not even on the camera. Oh, looks good to me. People around here really just don't care. Oh my God, if this guy wrecks when I'm right here, oh no. It is fucking, it's three in the afternoon, bro. What do you did? We'll just, uh, I kinda wanna pass him because I don't wanna be behind him if he falls. He's getting up there. He's like 12 o'clock. Uh, he ended. Oh, he saw the camera out. He's like, what up? <laughs> Bro, don't give a fuck. Man. So the powder coating place is down this way. I think it's called Coleman. On the GPS, it says it's called TNT. So I'm not sure which one it is or isn't, but uh, one of these. Nice. One last look at her. They're beautiful welds. So pretty. All right, here we go. All right, they got it. Got her in there, she's sitting on the ground back in a week or so out uh, running more errands after dropping off the downpipe just man i can't get over how good this car looks i just love it i just love it and the color i picked should match the color of my wheels when they're a little bit more clean it should be uh pretty spot on with that oh, that'll look really good in the engine bay or so i hope man all right boys about a week and a half, two weeks later. I don't remember the exact day. The we destination is on your right. Pull them back up. Fabrications and Let's go grab this downpipe. I'm super, super stoked to see this thing. All right, guys. It's so hard to do this one-handed because this baby's, you know, rather large. But there's, like, good flake in it. You see that? You see the flake on video? Dude. Dishman's. Right here. Yorktown. Virginia. Now this really should match my wheels like perfectly. I don't want to set this thing on the ground and scratch it up. We'll we'll try to get it. Sit it over here on my shoe. Oh, my wheels are freaking filthy. It just rained the other day. Look at that. That's like spot on. Hell yeah. I gotta get like a blanket out when I get home to like show. Damn, very nice. All right, guys, just wanted to end up this video real quick. Say hi, Apex boy. Sir? Sir, can you shake? Good boy, can you sit? Can you shake again? Can you do the other part? Oh, oh, that's so good, sir. Can I get a high five? High five. High five. Oh, hi, my good sir. Oh, Jay-Z boy. Hi, sir. You guys haven't been in a video in a minute. Can I get a, oh, thank you, boy. These are good sirs. You guys know you're not supposed to be on this bed, right? No, you're not even really supposed to be in here. 
keep you guys' fur out of everything. It's good, sirs. If you guys don't know, this is Jay-Z Boy. He's named after the two Jay-Z. Yes, sir. And this is Apex. Apex is named after the apex of a turn. See? And just some good sirs. And a full-bred Australian Shepherd. Going on five years old. And this is our almost three-year-old uh, Great Pyrenees and Rottweiler mix. He's about 120 pounds. Almost as tall as me. Just a big, big boy, aren't you? Yeah, he's just a good sir. He's a daddy's boy with your big head. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay, can I get back to this video? Okay, down, out, go, get, go, out of here. Go, get. Anyway, um, here we are. <laughs> There's some dog kisses. Came out really, 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 really nice. I was already asked. I posted this on Instagram today. Today's the next day, by the way. And uh, I was asked why I did this, even though you're not going to see it. Um, well, in the engine bay, there is a, like a heat shield that kind of hides this. And on the Mark 8 and 8Y, the turbo sits higher. So the downpipe sits a little higher. So you'll be able to see it a little bit better. And then when you get rid of that heat shield, which... I'm doing because this is coated. On the last car, it was coated or wrapped, depending on when I had the car. But it really drops the temps in the engine bay. So really, I don't think that heat shield is needed, and I think it's ugly. So I'm going to get rid of it when this goes on. So we'll be able to see it. And then with this custom intake, um, which we'll talk about when the time comes, um, that'll get color matched as well to the wheels and this. And I'll probably do some hardware in the bay, maybe some other small things to, uh, to match it up as well. So... We'll see how that goes when the time comes. I'm, I'm a real big engine bay guy. I like my engine bay to be nice and clean and presentable. So this is like the steps I'm taking. So hopefully the vision I have in my head, I can uh, bring into fruition in the future. But uh, yeah, here we are. Now I gotta wait about three more days. Hopefully after work Friday, we can toss this bad boy in, get you guys a little DIY. And of course, all the sounds you guys wanna hear, so. Be on the lookout. Again, I'll, I'll put the link in the description for this. And it cost me a little over 200 bucks to get it coated. And I think that was because it was mostly a special order color. We had to order it and wait for it and then, you know, all that stuff. So, anyway, there she is. Super excited. Really happy. And uh, just can't wait to go out and run around with this thing. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch you on the football. We're gonna be racing for about three thousand dollars here. And that's not enough money to replace anybody's car out here. All right.